फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू वोकैबलरी बिल्डिंग पार्ट टू हियर इज द फर्स्ट सेंटेंस द कंपनी वॉज फाइन वेन द गवर्नमेंट डिस्कवर्ड इट हैड यूज किमेरिकल डेटा टू गेट अप्रूवल फॉर इट्स न्यू ड्रग हियर इज द न्यू वर्ड किमेरिकल किमेरिकल डेटा वट डू यू मीन बाय किमेरिकल देर वॉज अ मॉन्स्टर नेम्ड किमेरा it had the head of a lion and the body of a goat and the tail of a serpent the name of such an incongruous and fantastic combination is used to denote a wild dream and illusion extremely fanciful therefore chimerical is used to denote wild dream and illusion which is extremely fanciful the synonyms are imaginary fantastic unreal visionary impossible absurd paradoxical stupid the antonyms are certain realistic established sensible and true here is the first sentence that the company was fined when the government discovered it had used chimerical data to get approval for its new drug here the company has used chimerical data it means what company has used unreal data which is not real which is not true it means it has used false data to get the approval for its new drug and therefore the company was fined the second sentence is overflowing garbage near the two villages has become visual shorthand for the city's chimerical dream to transform itself into a smart city here the term chimerical dream the city has a dream to transform itself into a smart city but because of overflowing garbage the dream has become chimerical it means the dream has become impossible the dream has become impossible it has become unreal and it has become absurd and so it is said that the city's chimerical dream the next sentence is if anything modi has shown that his government has no particular interest in chasing chimerical solutions for peace centered on kashmir chimerical solution for peace it means absurd solution absurd solution stupid solution or impossible solution and so the author says that modi has shown that his government has no particular interest in chasing chimerical solutions that is absurd solution stupid solutions or impossible solution for peace as far as the kashmir is concerned the next sentence is the big question is will congress move on if they have they will not opt for chimerical solutions like bringing in priyanka to replace rahul there was an increasing demand to bring priyanka to replace rahul but congress know that it will be of no use and so the congress will not opt for chimerical solution it means it will not opt for the stupid solution or absurd solution unreal solution of bringing priyanka to replace rahul friends the another word is sophistry when the poor case is turned into stronger case with the help of clever but deceptive reasoning we call it as sophistry the poor case that is the poor argument 
that is turned into the stronger one with the help of deceptive logic or deceptive reasoning and that is called as the sophistry the word sophistry is derived from greek word that is sophos and sophos means wise sophist means a group of teachers who achieved great fame in greece during the 5th century bc some of them were accused of making the weaker and worse reasons to appear stronger reason so actually the argument is weaker the argument is worse and just by the use of the language i should say here the clever use of language these arguments appear to be stronger and then we call it as a sophistry therefore the word sophistry has unfavorable connotation that is arguing deceitfully if someone is arguing deceitfully then we call it as a sophistry when the poor case is turned into stronger case with the help of clever but deceptive reasoning it is a sophistry synonyms are edification paralogy false logic flaw in the argument fallacy ambiguity equivocation evasion cunning and the antonyms are cleverness vision design artlessness here are a few sentences that yadav seems to have taken shelter in the sophistry of language and his arguments have no substance he cleverly used the language the words to explain his arguments and he proved that his arguments are better his arguments have some stuff in it but actually the arguments have no substance the another is but just three examples below will showcase how kejriwal posturing of fighting for the poor is sheer sophistry of a demagogue sheer sophistry means total sophistry fighting for the poor his arguments has no substance and so the author says it is nothing but a sophistry it means a clever use of language to cheat the voters another example is modi is not listening to such political sophistry that ignores crucial facts the arguments that ignores the crucial facts or important facts or the core facts modi is not ready to listen such arguments and so the author says that he is not listening to such political sophistry because it is everything is humbug there is no sense in the arguments there is no stuff in the argument but the arguments appears to be clever so we can say that sophistry is skillfully hiding or distorting evidence in pursuit of an unjustifiable goal if someone is pursuing unjustifiable goal and making the arguments by skillfully hiding or distorting the evidences then we call it as a sophistry it is nothing but the art of getting compliance through misleading arguments the arguments will be always misleading
friends the next word is posthumous posthumous means happening after someone's death but relating to something done earlier for example a book is published after death of the author or a child born after the death of the father or an award given after the death of the person it's called as posthumous award posthumous child or posthumous book the word is derived from latin posthumous alteration of posthumous and superlative of posterus it means coming after the word literary means subsequent subsequent means coming after but since it was often used in context relating to someone's death people began associating the word with humus that is earth or humer that is to bury the amended to spelling as posthumous which is we used in present days here is the sentence that lance nike mohan nath goswami has been posthumously awarded the ashok chakra posthumously awarded ashok chakra means this award was given after his death it is a sad commentary on the elite college that the principal is worried about the posthumous popularity of rohtas means after the death what is the popularity is gained that is called as the posthumous popularity another we can say as posthumous display of photos brings it to life means the photographs taken by someone are displayed or published after the death of that person can be said like this as posthumous display of photos taken by a particular person brings it to life he was found guilty of tax evasion in 2030 in a posthumous trial posthumous trial means the trial which is continued after his or her death so it is said he was found guilty of tax evasion in 2013 in a posthumous trial the another word is acrimony acrimony means bitterness or resentment synonyms are ill feeling hostility enmity animosity antagonism annoyance and fury the antonyms are kindness delicacy politeness affection sweetness agreeability amiability gentle kind hearted loving tender and warm friends here is a sentence it has been learnt that there was acrimony and mud slinging in the hall in the hall there was a exchange of hot words bitter words it means there was a fight between the two groups in the hall where the meeting was going on and so the because of the bitterness of the words the word acrimony is used here another sentence is the episode led to bitter acrimony between two groups another word is forgetting their past acrimony the over the issue of sri lankan tamils the dmk and congress on saturday said they would ally for the forthcoming assembly elections in tamil nadu indo asian news service on february 13 2016 previously there was a 
differences between the DMK and the Congress on the issue of Sri Lankan Tamils. But now they say that we forget our past acrimony means we forget our past differences and because of differences we have used the bitter words uh, exchanged bitter words and forgetting that all we are ready to ally for the forthcoming election in Tamil Nadu. Friends, recently AAP co-founder Prashant Bhushan and Yogendra Yadav were hounded out by of the party due to serious differences. There were differences Arvind Kesriwal and duo Prashant Bhushan Yogendra Yadav. The Economic Times of 10th February 2016 writes, the episode led to bitter acrimony between the two groups with speculation between the two groups about Arvind Kesriwal's inability to keep his flock together due to his autocratic style of functioning. Because of the autocratic style of functioning of Kesriwal, there was a bitter acrimony between the duo that is Prashant Bhushan and Yogendra Yadav and therefore both of them were ousted out of the party. The Live Mint in its web edition writes, internal acrimony led to ouster of our founding members Prashant Bhushan and Yogendra Yadav soon after Kejriwal government took over. Internal acrimony. There was internal bitterness between the two groups. A group which was following Arvind Kesriwal and the group following Prashant Bhushan and Yogendra Yadav. Friends, thank you very much for watching this video. I hope you must have enjoyed. If yes, please like it, share it with your friends and do not forget to subscribe the channel because every update will get into your mailbox thank you very much friends you might have enjoyed this video then go to thumbs up button and click then go to share tab and share with your friends on facebook twitter google plus and many more and to get the updates right in your mailbox don't forget to subscribe thank you very much